Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. This week we are in beautiful Del Mar, California, overlooking these impressive canyon views, about to tour this estate behind me. This estate features six bedrooms, nine bathrooms, 15,264 square feet of interior space. It's built on a three acre lot, and this estate is currently on the market for just under $16 million. This estate has some of the most insane hotel-like amenities I have personally ever seen before, including this massive infinity edge pool, a theater room, a two-story water feature, a mini golf course up above, so many more things. I'm really excited about this tour. Before we start, I wanna say a huge thank you to the two listing agents, Dan and Chris, for allowing us to come out here and tour their impressive listing for you all to see. And now, let's go ahead and get started. Now beginning our tour from the top of the property, on my right hand side you can see that's where we have access from the street. You've got this gated entry, massive private driveway taking you all the way down to your motor court. And you know the reason why I wanted to start up top is because before you even head down to your property, you have this vast grass area further taking you into a mini golf course. It's accompanied with two sand pits, plenty of landscaping offering so much privacy three acres of land that utilized it extremely well and we have seriously so much to see today. Now we're coming down this section and this is pretty much the private driveway further taking you down into your massive motor court. We've never seen a motor court of this size or of this magnitude on this channel ever before. This is the first time and I mean it's lined with massive full grown palm trees. One of the most insane water features I think ever in any residential home. Now we're coming down towards the entry and we're on this private stone made bridge. Water features on either side of me. This is a very tranquil and zen experience. I love the landscaping featured on my right and my left hand side. It kind of feels like we're in a luxurious hotel in Hawaii, but again, we're just at your estate. Now we're coming down through this section. Again, a very zen like experience before you even enter the property. And we have massive pivot door. Let's head inside. All right, everyone, so as you can see, we have just made it into the entry of this impressive estate located here in Del Mar, California, and this space is lined with carefully curated artwork, which complements the area very well. On my right-hand side, we have the primary suite, and we're gonna see it in just a bit, but look at how grand this hallway really is. It's extremely spacious, and again, are we in a hotel lobby, or are we in a mega mansion? I don't even know anymore. This is so cool, but I just wanted to show you that, but now I wanna further take you down through this section right over here, and we have the primary suite beautiful hardwood floors all throughout the area. You have nice hanging light fixtures on either side of this bed. Picture window views from your bed. Imagine waking up to this every morning. We've got some seamless indoor outdoor living, beautiful landscaping all throughout this space. You have a decomposed granite trail further taking you down into your impressive backyard. And these stairs lead you into a private spa accompanied with some impressive modern tropical plant life. I think this is really the life. This is one of the best homes we've ever featured on the channel. And you'll notice above me, we have a raised ceiling design with that nicely integrated LED strip lighting. So more of that floating cabinetry right over here. And as you can see from this space, we have just made it into your primary bathroom space. First coming in, we have a nice little built-in sink accompanied with refrigeration because that's very essential in a bathroom, right? That's pretty cool. But first coming into this area, it's extremely spacious. You have a nicely constructed bathtub right here. Beautiful stone designs all around that area. And it's actually nicely accompanied with this double-sided fireplace. You have dual sinks and dual showers in this primary suite. And on my left-hand side, this happens to be one of them. So you have this beautiful vessel sink design right here. I love the way they carved the stone out. Nice mirror and some wall sconces positioned on either side. 
beautiful area. Right here, very interesting, we actually have your glass enclosed water closet. Nice attention to detail, I think it's pretty cool how they made it like that. And then we open this up and we have shower number one. You have beautiful stone details on this side, dual rain heads and linear drainage down below, but checks all the boxes. And can you believe that's only the first shower of this space, which is crazy. So I wanna further take you through this section. Over here on my left-hand side, we have water closet number two. And if you follow me down through this space, we have sink number two, exact same stone design that we saw earlier. And you also have outdoor access, further taking you into your private hot tub. Really cool. Now, follow me through here. My left-hand side, we've got the sauna. So much bench seating, all clad with this beautiful wood. It smells incredible in here. Also, the door is nicely glass paneled as well. I like to see that. And then we close this up. On my right-hand side, we have another glass enclosed walk-in shower. So that makes two so many amenities just in the primary alone, including your very own massage room. Your massage room is positioned to have beautiful views of your motor courts, of your two-story water feature and your single-story water feature right over here. And then also something else, you slide this door back and this space takes you out into your private stone enclosed jacuzzi area and back into your motor court. So I like that a lot, that's really cool. And what else I like is that you can access that private hot tub from three different spaces in this primary bathroom, which is really cool. Now we're coming back down through the space. That's where we have access back into the primary suite. But before we do that, we have to of course check out the closet. It's extremely spacious. You have custom wooden cabinetry all around the area. You've got full body mirrors. You have floating glass shelving. You have it all in here. This is amazing. Now we're coming back down over through this section. And as you can see, we are led back into the primary suite. It's remarkable. Something else I forgot to mention. This is the other side of that dual fireplace, which we did see in the primary bathroom. But let me know your thoughts on this primary suite. I think it's really cool. and. The fact that we started our tour on it is something cool too. Now, I wanna take you back down through this section. Also, I wanted to mention, you have a beautiful centerpiece at your entry. I think this complements the home very well. Beautiful. Now, I wanna further take you over to my right-hand side and we have the private office. You have two working spaces positioned inside of this office, raised ceiling design, and also something I wanna go ahead and show you really quickly. This is a several million year old fossil that they have nicely integrated right above your fireplace. That's something I personally have not seen at a property before, but how cool is that? Seriously. Also, they have actually integrated fossils into this stone countertop right here, also on this one. You also have this beautiful dual fireplace, which takes us into the formal dining room, which we're about to check out. And it's also clad on this side with ebony wood. So you got the rosewood and the ebony complement each other very well. Now I wanna further take you down over through this space. I mean, as I said earlier, it is such a spacious hallway. This looks so impressive. And over on my left-hand side, you can see that we are led into your formal dining area. Seating for 14 of your guests in the center of this room. And of course, accompanied by that dual-sided fireplace, which we saw just a bit earlier. You're getting tons of natural lights, views of the canyon as well, raised ceiling detail. And also on this side, you'll see that we have beautiful artwork, glass paneled cabinetry, and some additional shelving spaces. And of course, they're all soft closing as well. Very convenient. I think this is a really cool area. Imagine having you and 13 of your other best friends here. I mean, you can absolutely do it. Now, before we head down into the kitchen and the living space, I wanna further take you down over to my left-hand side and we have the powder room. Possibly one of the largest powder rooms I have ever seen before in a residential home. You have backlit onyx stone on my left-hand side, completely covering this side of the wall. We also have some stone design bench seating, which really complements the area well. I like that. Now, I wanna further take you down through here. Behind these glass doors, we have a beautiful courtyard area framed with impressive plant life, and you have a pig statue overlooking the canyon views. I've never seen a pig statue before, but this home is full of interesting artwork and surprises, and again, I'm really excited for this one. Now, down this hallway, we have access over into your laundry space, which can fit four appliances, and you have access into your six-car garage area. But now, I wanna further take you down over through this space right here, and as you can see, we are led back into the main hallway. Again, it really looks like a hotel. It's crazy. 
But on my right hand side, let's talk about the staircase for a little bit. You have that floating modern design taking you up to level three or down below into level one, but this looks so great. Glass panels all around the area, chandelier suspended right above, looking out to the canyon. This is a true statement piece of a staircase. This is amazing. Also, one more thing I wanna show you. We've got the elevator access on my right hand side. Now, as you can see from this space, we are seamlessly led into your great room. First coming in here, this area must take up several thousand square feet. This is a huge area. We're getting tons of natural light from the skylight positioned perfectly in the center of the space. We've got vaulted ceilings with wooden beam designs all around me, picturesque views of the entire canyon. Now on my right hand side, we have another nice little separated seating area. We have the massive mounted flat screen TV, of course accompanied with some beautiful artwork and of course beautiful canyon views. You can probably entertain hundreds of people at this property. More unique artwork. Also one more thing I want to go ahead and show you, this grand fireplace. This stone design extends all the way up to the ceiling. This is such a great statement piece for this room. And what else I like about this room is that it's a very open concept. I can see straight down to my front door, to my living space, to my kitchen, to my secondary kitchen. And also, did I mention, you actually have access into a nice patio area. It's nicely glass paneled with beautiful views of the canyon. You have a mounted flat screen TV, built-in fireplace to match the one that we did just see. And we also have some more of the vaulted ceiling beam designs up above. And something else I wanna go ahead and show you, you have a nice little outdoor kitchen setup right here. So you've got your outdoor barbecue, grill station, and a couple of pull-out refrigeration drawers over here on my right-hand side. But this is awesome. And this is kind of a little sneak peek of the backyard. Also, you actually have spiral staircase access taking you back up to this area. A lot of things to see in here. And on that note, I wanna further take you to my right-hand side where we have the informal dining room. Of course, getting beautiful views of the palm trees, chandelier hanging right above. Now I wanna take you down through my right-hand side. And as you can see, we have the inner workings of the kitchen. On my left-hand side, we have a melee designed espresso machine. We have the microwave situated right below. More rosewood cabinetry complementing the entire area built-in sink. We've got your six burner stove top, oven displayed right below, and a very interesting hood design. It's kind of suspended from the ceiling. It's also nicely glass paneled. And I've never seen this before in a kitchen, but you have a built-in wok burner. Really cool, I like that. And then also right over here, we've got your panel dishwasher nicely clad with that rosewood. We have dual sinks again, and we also have some pull-out refrigeration drawers conveniently located right next to your original size refrigerator. So you definitely have options in this kitchen, which is really cool. And then you have some more conveniently shaped shelving. So they nicely utilize the space. Now to my left-hand side, we've got kitchen number two. In case that kitchen was not enough for you, well, we've got a second one. You can get this one all dirty, keep your other one clean. You've got another four burner stove top designed by Wolf, another hood above, and it's also accompanied with another microwave, oven setup, dual sinks, more refrigeration. As I said, you've got options in this property. You have everything you could possibly need. Now on that note, that pretty much wraps up our entire tour of this main floor. So now we have to head down below and check out that entertainment floor. Let's do it right now. All right, everyone. So as you can see, we have just made it down into your lower dedicated entertainment floor. And first coming in here, we have a lot to see. First of all, we have a massive living room, shuffleboard table, pool table, ping pong table, bars. We have insulated wine rooms, so much to see. But before we cover that, I wanna show you this right here really quickly. So we're coming through here and we've got the movie theater. I love this area so much. You've got beautiful recliner seating for eight at this section along with two bean bags conveniently placed right in front of your massive screen. The walls are nice and paneled for you to give you that true soundproof effect. And something else very interesting is that at the very front of the movie space, we've got your dedicated bar area. Also on my left-hand side, we have a nice little built-in sink area. And of course, open this up. We've got your handy refrigeration, always essential for any movie theater for real. And then we also have a popcorn machine. Never see that before inside of movie theaters, but I think that is really cool. 
I'm such a fan of this space. Also, I wanted to mention to you, on my right hand side, we have the elevator access. We saw it a little bit earlier, and now we've got the living space. We have custom built cabinetry all along this side with some floating shelving, and we have really cool sports memorabilia all around the space. We have a signed Tom Brady jersey and also a signed Celtics jersey. And I think this is really cool. We don't see personalized living rooms like this too often, but to see this is really remarkable. And what else is cool is that from this area, you can actually slide all of these glass doors right here, taking you out to that impressive backyard, which we'll see in just a second. And also I wanna mention this as well. You're getting picture window views of the entire canyon, which looks so beautiful. I mean, that view would never get old to me. I think that's amazing. As I said earlier, you have a shuffle boarding table positioned next to your pool table with some nice light fixtures above, positioned next to your ping pong table. So you definitely have options down here. You can literally play whatever game you want, invite hundreds of people down here at this space and have the time of your life. If you get bored of watching a movie, play pool and you can relax by your massive fireplace. Take a look at the size of this for a second. Take me for reference. I mean, this is seriously crazy. And you also have those nice sphere designs in there too. I think those always look really cool. Now I wanna further take you down through this section and over on my right hand side, we have a fully equipped bar area. We have your built-in refrigeration with a kegerator right here and built-in ice maker, always a really cool feature. And then of course, custom cabinetry all throughout. And then we got high ceilings, raised ceiling design too. So you'll see those nice LED light strips all throughout the area, giving it some more character and a nice detail. Now, I wanna further take you through this space. On my left-hand side, we have a powder room with a very interesting sink. And now I wanna take you into this space because this is a very unique area. So you actually have two temperature-controlled wine rooms. Now, first coming in here, I mean, this is seriously insane. You can store hundreds, if not a few thousand wine bottles inside of here. And they've also nicely constructed a ladder in here to get those hard to reach bottles from up above. And as I mentioned, it's fully temperature controlled. It's actually pretty chilly in here. So I'm gonna go ahead and close that up. And it's also nicely glass paneled on the door too, which I think is a really cool feature. Nice attention to detail at this property. And positioned outside of this room is a really cool little wine tasting area. And then you open this up, we actually have a secondary wine bottle storage area too, with a built-in ladder, which is really cool. I like seeing those details. And coming out of this space, one more thing I wanna to talk to you about, the dumb waiter, which we saw up above in the kitchen. So cool to have that. I've never seen that at a residential home, but now we've seen it, which is really cool. And then of course, this space is also lined with beautiful artwork all around and collector's items. And we've been talking about the backyard an awful lot, so why don't we just check it out right now? All right, everyone, so as you can see, we have just made it out into the stunning backyard space. And as we're first coming out, you'll see that this area is lined with seating sections. We actually have a fully built-in fireplace with this stone design extending all the way up to the ceiling. And on my left-hand side, that's where we have that nice spiral staircase, which I mentioned to you a little bit earlier. Again, I love the curved glass details and that silver railing traveling down to the bottom. I think it looks really nice. And when I first come out to this backyard, my eyes are immediately drawn into this massive pool space. You even have seating situated inside of the pool. I love when I see that. And of course, it's overlooking the gorgeous views of the canyon, and that will never be built on either. This is a permanent view. It will never change, which I love. But seriously, this pool is just so remarkable. You can probably fit like 80 people inside of here, play volleyball with all your friends. I mean, it's remarkable. And then of course, you've got pool chair seating all along this section. This is probably like over 10 chairs. You can even fit more too because of how spacious this really is. And we have the pool house situated on my left-hand side. I don't want to take you there just yet because we have a lot more to see. So actually, I want to backtrack just a little bit, take you back up these stairs right here. And right here, you'll see another one of these beautiful sculptures and I think they look great. We actually have another one right over there. Looks so cool, kind of looks like Mickey Mouse or something, but we'll talk about it in a bit. But right here, this is just so crazy. I mean, this fire pit was actually carved out of a massive boulder. You've got all of the seating constructed around this space. You've got some more palm trees. This is gonna be the collection of them that we have right here. You'll see we have probably eight or nine of them just on this section. 
Now we're coming back down. Of course, we got to talk about the outdoor kitchen. We have the barbecue positioned perfectly in the center of this area. Warming trays below, you've got your grill station. You have dual refrigeration spaces, built-in ice maker on my right, built-in sink, and my favorite feature, hidden TV. Press a simple button, it just disappears into the stone as if it was never there. I think that's amazing. And then of course, you got some nice little light fixtures on either side. And then you have your massive built-in outdoor dining table. I say built-in because if you take a look down right here, literally built in that's really cool i don't see stuff like that too often usually it's just staged but not here which is awesome and then here we have another beautiful art piece as i said they're all conveniently positioned just far enough away from each other that you just get astounded every time you see them more palm trees all around the space down on my right hand side that's actually where we have access into your private gym and basketball court but we'll wait to see that so I wanna take you down further through this section right over here, and this space is going to open up into your guest property. You can see you have built-in cabinet spaces all along my right, and then on my right-hand side, we have a very similar fireplace to the one that we did just see out here on the outdoors. And we're further stepping through this space, and we have your well-equipped kitchen. It's complete with a oven, a microwave, five burner stove top, built-in melee hood, sink, and of course, accompanied by those picturesque views. Now on my right hand side, we have a full size bathroom equipped with a glass enclosed walk-in shower. So that's pretty much how you know you have everything you possibly need at the guest property. Also, it's conveniently placed with these sliding glass doors, sectioning off the area. And one more thing I wanted to talk about, look at your property accompanied by the views of your pool and the reserve in the distance. This right here to me is a perfect view. I don't think it gets much better than this. I really like that. Now, there's actually one more component of the guest property that I wanna go ahead and show you. So on my left-hand side, you actually have a half bathroom. So that's pretty much ideal for all of your guests using a pool bathroom if they need to change or anything. And then take a look at this. Outdoor shower as well. And what's interesting is that it's actually a collection of four individually placed rain heads. So to have that is extremely ideal and I mean, talk about attention to detail at this home. You have everything. I mean, every little detail was perfectly thought out, which is amazing. And now we're coming down this dirt trail right here, accompanied again with some incredible landscaping. And if you take a quick guess, you can see we've got the basketball court. I mean, this is really true luxury, having this massive basketball court at your own property, not to mention it's accompanied with some impressive landscaping, views of the reserve and all of you Boston Celtics fans, the owners, as you can see, are fans as well, which is really cool. Now, I wanna further take you down over through this section, and this is actually another part of the guest house. We've got the gym. This is just like 24-hour fitness. You have every machine you could possibly imagine, and this space is also nicely mirrored all around too, so you're really getting that perfect gym feel. No gym is complete without some built-in refrigeration. Store all of your water bottles there. Then you have a built-in sink, plenty of cabinetry, and then it's also complete with a half bathroom and built-in body spray, which is really convenient for any gym. Now, that pretty much wraps up our tour for the entire backyard and, of course, this beautiful guest suite, the basketball court. We've seen a lot today, but we have some more to see. We gotta head upstairs and check out all of the bedrooms, so let's go ahead and do that right now. As you can see, we have just made it up to the third and the final level here at this estate here in Del Mar, California. As we saw earlier, we have an impressive chandelier, natural light coming in, accompanied with this artistic-like floating staircase. Looks really cool. On that side, we have access into the elevator, but I wanna further take you down this hallway. Let's make a right-hand turn, and this space opens up into a guest bedroom. This room gets tons of natural light during the day, accompanied with this balcony setup, which gets beautiful views of the canyon and of the palm trees over there in the distance. Very spacious as well. And also something very interesting, you actually have kind of like a little built-in desk area straight into the wall. I think that's really cool. I like that. Now, we come down through this section and we have the ensuite bathroom. As we first come in, we have this exaggerated floating vanity setup with a massive sink. And then on my left-hand side, that's where we have your built-in bathtub, natural light coming in. And you also have your seamlessly integrated shower area 
built-in rain head, unique stone design, body sprays, you have it all at this property. Now, I wanna further take you down over to my right-hand side, and we have the closet on my right, currently under storage, so we're not gonna check that out today. We have secondary primary suite on my right, but before we see that, I wanna take you down to another bedroom. So follow me down through here, and this space opens up into yet another bedroom. You got another balcony overlooking the canyon and the beautiful palm trees. And as we saw in the last one, you actually have another nice little built-in desk area. Really nice. And then on this side of the wall, massive built-in mirror. I think it's really cool to have that inside your bedroom. Now we also have the ensuite bathroom right here. Let's go ahead and take a look inside of here. You got custom cabinetry all throughout the space. Further follow me through here. You got your motion sensor toilet as you come up. And what's really interesting is that they've kind of just integrated the shower into your water closet area. So it's very nice and seamless, very spacious. It could be a primary essentially because of how large it is, but it's not. It's just a regular bedroom in this 15,000 square foot home. Now, on my left-hand side, we have your secondary laundry area with space for two appliances. And I wanna further take you to my right-hand side and we have your secondary primary suite. Again, during the day, this space gets a ton of natural light. You have the bed situated on my left-hand side and you've got your dual-sided fireplace on my right, mounted flat screen TV, and this space also has an ensuite bathroom over here on my right-hand side. Let's go ahead and take a look inside of here. You've got your built-in bathtub on the far side of the wall, of course, accompanied by that dual-sided fireplace, which is really cool to have. We've seen it so many times through this home, which I really just love that. You have the dual sink set up on my left-hand side, and also you've got water closet on my left, and you've got the shower space inside of here, tons of natural lights. You've got your built-in rain head and your built-in body spray inside of this area. It definitely checks all the boxes and you have everything you could possibly need inside of this home. Now, I want you to follow me back down through this section, and that is pretty much going to wrap up our tour of this entire 15,000 square foot estate here in Del Mar, California. If you stuck around throughout the end of this video, I just wanted to say thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And please, as always, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, comment down below if you haven't already, and please make sure to hit that notification bell so you can be notified every time I post a brand new tour. And of course, I wanna say again, a huge thank you to the two listing agents, Dan and Chris, for allowing us to come out here and show their amazing listing to you all. Feel free to contact them for any inquiries and I will see you next week.